Oh guys, <laughs> we're headed to California. California, here we go. California, here we come. We are on our flight. We just boarded our flight to LA and we will land in LAX. And then... Good the afternoon folks from Flight Deck, welcome aboard. American Eagle Flight 49 we just got to the airbnb we're tired it's been see like you can see the bags under my eyes it's been a very very long day we had a rough time at the rental car place i say rough time it could have been a lot worse, honestly. Don't you think it could have been worse, Jira? Could have been. We waited for like how long? 30, 45 minutes no, in line no. because it was just so busy. But we got a cutie little Airbnb, cute little kitchenette. Very cute. We had plans. Also, we have a washer and dryer, which is so nice. We had plans to go to Trader Joe's and all these tonight. But we are absolutely exhausted and fried. So I think we're both going to just shower and go to sleep. And then hopefully in the morning, get everything done that we want to get done. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. We are headed to a gluten-free bagel place that I am so excited about. I've had it saved in my phone forever. Everything there is gluten-free. And I am more than excited to like eat all of the bread and eat everything without feeling crappy afterwards. I'm getting into our rental car right now. Um, you can see kind of LA behind us. And there's Jarrah. <laughs> our Airbnb is nice, we're happy, we got some sleep. This smells weird in this car. Okay, anyway. So we are going to go get breakfast. And then after breakfast, we're going to go to Trader Joe's and Aldi and get all of our little groceries, for, little the groceries for the week because we need that. But guess what? Uh, Airbnb doesn't have um, ice maker or water. We're sad about that. Which is so annoying. we're going to... Jared really, really likes I ice. I like ice. <laughs> if I'm going to carry a bottle with me for the day, I need it to stay cold when I need ice. I just, um, I just like cold water, so I don't really care that much. But we do need some good spring water. I'm not drinking from, I'm not drinking from the tap. The tap smelled bad last night. Oh no! I was brushing my teeth. Really? Is LA California water, water a thing? I don't know. I've heard Cal LA tap water is bad. Okay, well, LA tap water is bad. We don't know that for sure, but <laughs> that's what we think, and that's what we're going with. So Maybe. anyway, we're excited for a good day. After we do all of that, we're supposed to meet Dean in a little bit at the Little House Festival where it's gonna be. We are still two days early. So today is Tuesday. The Little House Festival starts on- Today's Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. <laughs> and the Little House Festival starts on Friday. So we have today and we're gonna see where they're like setting everything up and setting the set up and everything. And then tomorrow is media day, which apparently we are we're media. media. <laughs> but the festival actually starts on Friday. I'm oh, a lot of sinners. Guys, we're here in front of the little house, and Jarrah's here with me. Jarrah, where are we? We're at Little House on the Prairie. Little House on the Prairie. There is an indoor set of this. Let's go over here so we can okay. show them the indoor set of it all. It's looking absolutely beautiful out of this world. Look at this. This is the interior. It's looking stunning. Like seriously, they've outdone themselves. And then in front of me, if I turn around, that's the Olsen's Mercantile. Like, are you joking? The amount of work that they have put into this is unreal. It's so gorgeous. And then here is the church and the school. They have recreated it, scale to size, stunning. You can see the readers and the slates. 
Is it not just the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? They have seriously outdone themselves. Uh, today is media day, so all of the cast will be here and then the local media to take pictures and interviews. And so Dean's running around here somewhere. And Jared's actually going to be with Karen all weekend, which who plays Maul. So Jara will be her right hand all weekend. And this is so fun. And then I have to show you this. These were all recreated by the amazing Laura Ingalls Gunn. She's over here talking to Jara right now. Say hi, Laura. Good morning. Welcome to the 50th anniversary celebration of Little House on the Prairie. Now you recreated all of these in how many days? Um, two and a half months. Wow. So that's a lot of work, lot and of you did pause. such, <laughs> you did such an incredible job. Thank you very much. It Thank looks you. beautiful, Laura. Thank you. This is Anna Community Center. We are standing inside the panel tent. We're calling it. There's Ma and Pa in the wagon. We are in Walnut Grove. There's the Olsen's Mercantile. There's the church. There's Jara. <laughs> Welcome to Walnut Grove. <laughs> Manly's over here. And then there's Miss Beetle. Miss Beetle, say hello. Oh, who am I talking to? The internet? <laughs> the internet? Well, the internet, you know, I talk to you all the time, but that's great. Welcome to Walnut Grove. Welcome to, and you got to see your church and my your school, school. My schoolhouse is right, right there. And you got to take some yeah. pictures. Does it feel so good and surreal? Yeah. I, I had no idea. Who would have thought 50 years ago that this would be going Yeah, you'd you be know? here talking to everybody. In fact, you know. Okay, oh, we, we got to get, get on the bus. So, another shot of the blind school account. And there's the little house, you guys, and the barn. It's so beautiful. This has been one of the most wild experiences that I've ever had. What about you, Jer? How are you feeling? Surreal. Did you cry? I have not cried, but it's very. I surreal. did cry. I've, I, I was very maybe emotional. I will later. when I saw the little house. Is when I cried. I lost it. Lost it. Also, Miss Beetle's right there. She's sitting right there with us. Allison's also here. Who plays Nelly. And then Dean's out here talking to the people that own the ranch. So they're snake wranglers. Snake wranglers because there are a little bunch of snakes. We are in a little bit of traffic this morning and we are headed to the first day of the festival. How are we feeling out there tonight? We're feeling great. Feeling great. Jara is going to be with Karen all weekend, so that's going to be super sweet and fun. And I'm going to be with Dean, and we're very excited, guys. It's going to be a good day. It's early in the morning. We're going to get there at like 8.50. The event actually opens at 10, so it will be. it's going to be a great day. It's going to be a great day. I'm so excited. Get, get Let's high. go. Let's go. Like stool, a stool. So if you, I can, Do you want I a stool or? Oh, I'm so glad you're here. I'm hey. so glad you're here. I finally made it. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. This is for my YouTube channel. Okay. So we are at the table. The doors are about to open. How was yesterday for you? Yesterday was great. Yeah. It was. It was I don't think the event day. could have gone better than it did yesterday as a first day. Just incredible. The people, the weather, the, yeah. the tours went perfectly. Everything worked. It was great. It was a great day. And we're yeah. ready for another full day. Yes. Dean's about to do a panel with Lucy called Meet the Wilders, and it's going to be so fun. Simpler way. And I think, you know, when you, when you experienced, when you watched him on the set, you, you know, and you saw how his, he hit the lens. It was just unbelievable how he hit the lens. So it was just, it was, a, it was an acting lesson to watch Michael work. So anyway, so I'm reading for him and he's, he's sitting over there, out of the corner of my eye, I see him doing this with his hands. 
and he's looking at me and I think, oh my God, I'm like, I'm in the ball game here. This is really cool. But like Lucy, and he asked me when I was done, what are you doing in May? Now this is like, you know, this is like late, this is mid-April. What are you doing in May? I said, well, I'll be finishing, or what are you doing May 15th? I said, well, I'll be finishing my final exams. He said, well, I th we want to start then, but I think we can wait another week. Thanks very much for coming in. And I said goodbye. And now, I, it was like he, he hired me in the room. Sorta. Yeah, but he didn't hire me for another two and a half weeks. So, <laughs> so I'm editing this video right now and I just wanted to put a little tidbit in here. This sweet little moment that you just saw with Linwood and Karen, this is the first time they had seen each other since the show wrapped. And so that was a really, really big deal. And it was a very sweet moment to witness. Big tales on today. She has her whole family with her. So I think she's going to stop here next. Are we dancing? <laughs> oh my God. There we go. That'll, that'll, that'll get you. Are you a question? I am too. I have no problem. Good morning, everybody. Oh. Jarrah and I are here on the last day of the festival, and we are exploring a little bit before we get our day started. It is There's already massive lines to see everybody, lots of tents and food trucks set up. Jarrah and I are gonna go try to get some merch. We'll at least look around and see what we can find. Today, I speak on a panel about Little House being a safe place, and that's gonna be so fun, but it's just been a crazy few days. Jerry's right. been with Karen the whole time. She's yeah. having so much fun. Karen is an absolute sweetheart. And so we are just having the best time. Six months ago, I did a collaboration at a little house event in Pahuska, Oklahoma. And that's where I met Dean. And we started talking. And he's like, Jen, I have this book coming out. And I have no social media. I was like, well, let's talk. <laughs> You're gonna hire me right here, right now, and let me just do it. And I, it's so crazy. I only knew him for two days. I left with his Instagram login, and I'm literally, my husband and I are headed home from the Huska, and I'm like, I have Manly's account <laughs> right here on my phone. Hi, friends. I haven't videoed in the last few days because it's been insane um today is tuesday so we've been here a week now we leave back home for tulsa tomorrow it has been a little bit of a crazy weekend jara woke up yesterday not feeling very well at all she has history of issues with breathing and her lungs and so has to do with her chronic illnesses and her autoimmune stuff and so we had to take her in yesterday and the doctor prescribed her a bunch of medicine and she's feeling better today so i'm very thankful for that we i thought we were gonna have to cancel our warner brothers studio tour but we're not we're about to leave right now i'm waiting for her to come out she was filming inside so i'm very excited about this tour we're gonna get to see gilmore girls set and the friends set and actually be on a live set which is so fun and then i did a podcast episode with little house that went so well. I was able to speak on the panel on Sunday and that went really, really well. And I will share like a clip of me sharing my story and that went really, really well. And it's just been a wild trip. Like so, so much nostalgia, so much joy. It's been so fun. So I will try. I hope that this video is actually fun because I don't feel like I got a ton of content. Um, as much as I wanted to. And I know that I can't video on the tour. I can take pictures, but I can't video. So I will try to video some more before we leave tomorrow and then we're gonna head back home. I have some really fun stories to tell that I, when I get a chance to sit down maybe this evening, I will try to film you some more. Did you talk this close? I did. Do you wanna say hello to everyone really quick? Oh, hi. So where are we going? Get to Warner Brothers. <gasps> We're gonna get to tours. see an actual studio set. Are you ready? I didn't get my sunglasses. 
You want to use mine? Do you have extra? Yeah. In here? Yeah. Okay, it's fine. Say bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> I look a little crazy. So. About to watch some video and then go on the door. Probably about the founding of Warner Brothers. Which a, a family from a long time ago, I'm guessing. Just like we don't care about that. We just want to see the sets. <laughs> Guys, where are we, Jara? The friend said. Oh. I'm back home now and I'm just wanting to wrap this video up by telling a few really sweet stories and some of my favorite moments. One of my favorite things was meeting Ketty Lester um, who played Hester Sue. She is an absolute doll. You've seen a quick interaction of her and Dean in here. Loved her. I also was able to get some content for Patrick and Dean and I'll put a short clip right here. Hey guys, so uh, I'm Patrick Laberto. I play Andy Garvey on Little House on the Prairie, and I am here with Mr. Dean Butler, who played Almanzo Thank Wilder, you but as we know him, Almanzo. It's really the people that are coming dressed as all of the, you take a shot there, they're yeah. waiting. It's like yeah, an yeah. hour before. Yeah. And they're waiting to get in to have this adventure, and I'm sure you've seen the pictures of the sets that you guys put together, uh, the tour, which I haven't even got a chance to be on yet. I hear it's amazing. Working with Andy and Almanzo, Almanzo, Manly, whatever you want to call him, because he has many names these days, was a dream come true. And spending time with Karen was so much fun. Karen Crassley is an absolute joy to be around. My sister had so much fun working with her and we wanted to take a picture together. And at the end, she, when, when we were about to take the picture, she just started singing Sisters. So here's a little clip from that. Do a video. Caring, <laughs> caring, every little thing that we are wearing. <laughs> I was also able to spend some really sweet time with the Landon children, with Leslie, Landon Matthews, and with Michael Landon Jr. And that was really cool. I was able to see their reactions for the first time to the sets, the interior sets that Dean showed them. And that was a really, really cool experience to witness. Overall, the entire festival was just out of this world and I was so thankful to be a part of it and spend time talking with some of you. Thank you to every person who came up and said hello. I think that this year you are going to be shocked of how many more events is coming. Uh, there are several cast members that are traveling around the United States doing all kinds of shows with Gravel Road. So just be on the lookout on Dean's socials for all of that. But it's going to be a very exciting year. Dean's book also comes out June 25th. So lots more to look forward to when it comes to Little House on the Prairie this year.